Hi, welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Cappies. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Capricorns. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy-ass temple of yours, Capricorns. As it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages, source your guardian angels and your ancestors have for you today, Capricorns. Shout out to the Evolving Spirits. Shout out to the Soul Tribe members. Gang, gang, I appreciate you all. Welcome back, all right? Definitely thank you so much, Evolving Spirits, for your continuous love and support. If you would love to become an Evolving Spirit, Capricorns, and join the Soul Tribe like I myself, click that join link down below, all right? It does provide you exclusive, unlimited access and discounts for personal readings, email questions, and love live stream questions cappies when i go live as well all right check us out we have our own private community where i do post daily content there as well my loves all right so shout out to the evolving spirits gang gang i appreciate you all that's in here yes all right so let's go ahead and get into your reading here today capricorns we're first going to start with a message from your guardian angels and your ancestors all right and your higher self just to check in with you spiritually and see where you're at on your spiritual path and journey all right, and then definitely stick around. We're going to use the traditional tarot deck to dive into your love life. All right, we're going to see what's the potential outcome here for the month of October for love for Capricorns. All right, guardian angels, ancestors, please protect my space and aura as I channel the messages here today for my beautiful unicorns. What do we have for Cappies? All right. All right, so the first card we have out here is the Wheel of Fortune, right? Okay, the wheel, all right? It reminds me of the Wheel of Fortune, right? <laughs> okay, this is Sagittarius Energy Capricorns, okay? Some of y'all may be engaging here with a Sagittarius here, all right? We have a time of positive change here, okay? So sounds like things are now going to be start working out in your favor here, Capricorns, in the month of October, all right? It says a situation suddenly moves forward, yes, okay? This is what I was feeling here, okay? So something that may felt like you were at a stagnant or at a standpoint, okay? Or if it felt like things were moving slow, that's definitely because of the several planets going in reverse here, okay? So a lot of that lazy feeling, energy, sleepy, tired, not as much motivated to want to, you know, get things maybe done around the house or in regards to your career, your finances and things like that. That definitely explains the energy from those planets here that are over more than seven planets almost going into retrograde so that energy is definitely being felt here on a collective so it's like now that some of the planets here are now starting to go back direct especially mercury okay that's the big one which rules communication right so a lot of communication now is going to be coming in things are going to be more clear okay versus kind of you know stagnant and all over the place so you're going to be getting clear communication here coming in and i feel like this is what's going to allow the situation here to change suddenly here for you okay it literally says for fortune is on your side okay because things are about to suddenly move forward for you wow we have the number 10 here as well which talks about a completion okay so there is a cycle here that has finally closed out for you cappies and now you're going into a new cycle here okay yes i love it all right, we have the Empress here. Wow, shout out to the Divine Feminine Energies here. Okay, or Capricorns, we're needing to step into our Divine Feminine Energy, all right? We have Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine Energy within us, okay? So I feel like this time now that this wheel is moving forward here, this is the time for you to tap into that Empress Divine Feminine Energy and be creative, Capricorns, okay? It says lavish abundance here. Give birth to your dreams. Wow yes that's what i was meaning here it's time to tap into that feminine energy here and get creative okay nourish yourself and others okay so it's definitely going to be that time and that season here for you cappies to step into your creative part of you okay what makes you happy what is your dreams have always been what is the thing that have always lit up in you and gave you so much love and passion okay so i feel like it's now time to tap back into that now you're getting that opportunity because you have a situation here that's going to work out in your favor capricorns wow beautiful messages from your guardian angels and your ancestors loves if that resonated for you hit that big fat thumbs up show spirit some love 
All right, Duff, again, if you're new here, welcome, welcome. Subscribe, my loves, and be a part of family. Yes, this is definitely where we love and we evolve each and every day here on this platform, loves. All right, so let's now dive into your love life, Capricorns. Let's see what's coming towards you here in the month of October for love. What do we have for Cappies for love? What do we have for my beautiful unicorns here, Gordon Angels and such with the highest light? What do they need to know here when it comes to their love life? What's coming towards my beautiful Capricorns for love? All right, so the first card we have coming out here is the Four of Pentacles here. Hmm. All right, Capricorns, are you holding back a little bit here? This is your energy here, okay? We have Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo energy here. Or there could be an Earth sign here or a particular energy here that may be holding back when it comes to communication, putting in the effort, or even the time looks like here in this relationship here, okay? So is this something here that is occurring in regards to you holding back, Capricorns, or this particular energy? Let's see. We have the imprints here coming out again. Very strong statement here with the imprints here because we have the imprints card here and then we have the empress beautiful cards here okay divine feminine okay some y'all this is in regards to the mother or the father of your child who could be an emperor or an empress here okay so someone has recognized you as being the empress here as well for others of you all or the emperor here okay someone has now recognized this pedestal here that you are deserving to be on here or realizing this about you okay it was why i feel like some y'all now are maybe holding back from this particular individual here okay yeah there is someone here that is wanting to come in here some y'all this particular person here could be a fire sign here okay this could be a uh of course a sagittarius here aquarius Ooh, i heard aquarius wanted to come out mm, i want to say aries here okay so some y'all this is in in regards to a Aquarius here Capricorn all right but again we have Sagittarius energy here Aries and also Leo energy here as well okay there is someone here that is looking forward to manifesting a connection here with you but I feel like you are having your mind focused elsewhere and have manifested something else here again that is pertaining to your dreams your passions here okay something that was giving you an opportunity here with this wheel of fortune here that is now starting to work out in your favor and others of you all this connection here now that we are out of the retrograde energy for the mercury planet i feel like this person is wanting to come in but it's kind of going to be like you're going to be holding back from this particular person here and this could be several reasons because this person may have caused problems here in the past right so let's see why you're holding back let's clarify this four of pentacles energy here for you cappies clarify the four of pentacles here guardian angels why do we have the four of pentacles here for capricorn's energy guardian angels ancestors of the highest light clarify the four of pentacles for capricorn placements yeah we have the five of pentacles here okay some of you are this particular energy here feels left out in the cold because you're now holding back you know you have stepped into your higher self you are understanding who you are and you definitely are valuing your worth here okay and now this particular person as well is understanding this but it's like unfortunately now you're ready to move forward to your capricorns okay you're ready to see what else is out there for you okay and because you are deciding to do this there could be family members loved ones your significant other here or whoever you may have been in this previous relationship here with that you are now not putting the time the effort their energy in here is now these energies here are feeling left out in the cold here okay wow capricorns so let's get a uh Hmm. Let's see how they feel about this. Because they are feeling left out in a code here, let me first use the uh, Hidden Truth Oracle deck here, okay? And wow, as I am trying to pull out decks over here, a card came out of my Raw Tarot deck here, which has here, I will fight for you. Wow, so someone here is willingly to fight for you. It definitely could be this energy here that felt left out in a cold here or your ex or significant other here. Okay, let's see how they feel, what they want to say here at this time, Gordon Angels. Wow, Cappies, beautiful spread here. All right, definitely again, if the readings here is resonating for you, don't forget to like, subscribe, share the video, and be a part of family, my loves. Wow, I am also available for personal readings, Capricorns. If you would love to book a personal reading with me, all that information is down below, loves, in the description box. 
five loves, all right? So let's see what this particular person here wants to say. Wow, we have you and I were too young, Capricorns, okay? So this particular person felt like because of the decisions here that this person made towards you or this relationship here back in the past, they may feel like they may was even immature, right? If that's not the case, as far as there may be a gap uh, of age dif differences here or, you know, a space there this person could be younger than you or you could be younger than this person here but however this person felt like they were very immature or not in a stable adult adult manner mature place to make proper decisions here i feel like here cappies okay so now this person here just wanted to come towards you here as i mentioned and now they're willingly to fight for this relationship but it's like for some y'all it may be too late okay because you have other ideals things that you're wanting to move forward here with okay wow let's see here let's get you one card for a love message here as we close out your spread again definitely if the reading has resonated don't forget to like subscribe loves and hit the notification bell loves wow this is once again another beautiful spread here ladies. let's get a love message here gordon angels what do we have for my beautiful capricorns mm. All right. Wow. We have this could be the one Capricorns. You have already met the romantic partner you seek. OK, some of y'all, you've already met this particular person that you've manifested here that is coming in here for you. All right. We also have several other cards that came out. We have heart to heart conversations here, Capricorns. Honestly, discuss your feelings towards each other, okay? So for some of you all, in regards to this particular energy here that is feeling left out in the cold here, that is willingly to come back here and want to fight for this relationship here, okay? This particular energy here is someone that your guardian angels is requesting for you to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation here with, rather if you decide to move forward or rekindle this relationship here. Yeah, look at this. We have wedding. This situation involves marriage, okay? So so for some of y'all, you're definitely going to be reconciling with this person here. This person is wanting to come back towards to you and even propose to you for some of you all here, okay? Others of you all, you are meeting someone totally new, okay? This is someone totally new, and your guardian angels want you to keep an open mind, okay? They want you to, you know evaluate this situation here okay because this could be the one for you for this new energy here that's coming in here for others of you all yeah look at this we have released your ex the time has come to clear your energies okay so definitely you have a new energy here coming in towards you this month of october or sometime in the future here okay so it's definitely time for you to clear the energies clear the space here so this doesn't block you okay and others of you all in regards to this particular energy from the past that is filling left out in the cold okay it's time to release this particular person here it's going to be different for everyone okay so definitely if that resonates again don't forget to like subscribe hit the notification bell again i am available for personal readings capricorns if you would love to book a personal all that information is down below in the description box if you're new here again welcome all right select the notification bell so that way you can be notified for when i go live in the risings for wake and tarot all right we do have a good time there if you would love to come by hang out where we pull tarot cards i do that every rising monday through friday for all zodiac sign readings for awake and tarot all right also you can join me live on saturday nights capricorn i do go live for love live stream questions if you have a question in regards to your partnership your relationship you feel free more than happy to ask you can email me your question and i will provide you a number so that way you can remain anonymous during the live stream as well so that way you know because these crazy scammers and things like that out here i will place a timestamp right following after the live stream so that way you can always go back and reflect on your question during the week all right so just email me your question screenshot your payment and i will provide you that number and we'll get your spot and get you in the line for saturday night love live stream as well my loves all right thank you all capricorns for your continuous love and support i appreciate you i thank you all as i always say remember your health is your wealth all right take care of yourselves i love you cappies Mwah. bye bye